Well, hello, hello everyone, and welcome back. Welcome, welcome. Today, we will be doing Seven Days to Die again. But this time, for the last time, uh, I feel like we are getting all the content we really can from Seven Days. At this point, all we're doing is just surviving and killing zombies, which, while it is fun, it's kind of repetitive after a while, you know? So, I figured we'll uh, kind of wrap things up with a sort of survival journey. What I mean by that is, after we survive this initial horde at home, we will go back to roaming around quite a bit. So let's go ahead and start the game up. While it's loading, I can talk about that a little more. If you remember last time, we were trying to uh, see if we could get zombies to not spawn during the seventh day horde. Because we had found out that apparently, if there's a player placed block, a zombie won't spawn on it. And that there also seems to be a limit to how far away zombies can spawn during the night. So, as you can see, I set it back to 60 minutes so I could build some. We're going to drop it down to 30, uh, just because 10 minutes is kind of panicky. Because uh, if you look at it, 10 minutes, about about 24 hours, uh, is only like point 0.41 minutes per... Uh, Per day or per hour in game so that's not a great time for us to be there it was good when we were you know getting a bunch of zombies and stuff but i'd like to have us have some time to at least survive uh and do some stuff so anyway after we ended i uh, expanded the base to the west a bit as we needed to and i also fixed up the base and my god there was a lot of damage like a lot of damage things were like down to three thousand even 2,000 in some places damage. Uh, so it's a good thing I decided to do that. Regardless, I'll show you what I did, and we'll kind of go from there. So once the Laurel loads in, we will begin. And here we go. All right, so we're already in the little cavey cave. Nice and good here. If you go up here, you can see the whole area there has just been landscaped. I, I decided to go from the edge of that one, the edge of that area right there where we know zombies don't spawn there, and then usually they have like a radius to them where uh, zombies will spawn in a radius around you or stuff like that. I figured if, if they're not spawning here, and I just kind of do the same rough length, from here to here. And we know that they're not really spawning back here, or at least if they are, they were spawning like right on the edge. So I figured I could just kind of do a sort of rounded thing there and also ran out of time and we also ran out of other stuff. Building blocks mostly to do that. Um, regardless, that, that's what I did. See, everything's nice and perfect around here. Looks good. So, all we're going to wait to do is uh, we're going to make sure that my guns are loaded, first of all. They are. And we're going to wait here. Right here. After I turn on the generator, of course. And we're just going to see what happens tonight. Will I actually get a horde? Or will uh, I somehow have managed to cover everything. So, we'll see what happens. Is, uh, Muley had spawned over there previously, but will I have gone far enough? Question. We know that we have the front, the north covered. We can't spawn anywhere around there because it's pretty much solid concrete. Um, I think we have the east done. Maybe. Just maybe. And then south, I think we had that done. Hard to tell for sure. Alright, let's hold that baby. Let's see if we get any zombies coming. I don't see any yet. I don't see anything at all. Oh, right there. There's one. 
I guess the south is where they're coming from, and fortunately, we weren't back far enough to really do anything for that. I couldn't kill that zombie because I would, if I shoot there, it's gonna open up that area. And it looks like they're coming from back, like. Anyway, get him, turret. Okay, they're in. He's gonna go in here. seems like the answer to can you make it so zombies can't spawn on the seventh day is yes. Uh, because I'm only getting like five zombies here. They're having to spawn like just barely on the edge there. No ifs, ands, or buts. I'm on foot. Nice. But uh, yeah, there's definitely a way to, to prevent zombies from spawning during Fortnite. And thus beating the game just because you place down like thousands of blocks. That's good to know. So if you have the time to like find a flat area and build a huge base, even if it's just frames, it appears to work. So you definitely can. I love seeing them go back. Oh my god, it's so good. Back and forth, the ping pong, ping pong. Just sitting here. Why don't I drink some tea? Hello, sir. Okay. we're just kind of sitting here waiting for them to all do their thing. I'm going to start preparing for Fortnite, or for uh, our journey onward. Let's go ahead and grab all of our AP ammo, all the pistol ammo and stuff we can. There we go. I think I have way too much magnum ammo at this point. Way too much. If I search 44, yeah, I still can't make the desert vulture. Unfortunate. I hate to see it. I'd much prefer that over Maggie. I think, I think. Is that all? Everyone done? We good? But yeah, even though we are at um, game stage 474 and uh, all this, we really aren't seeing any enemies, which is just really cool. Which means that we definitely succeeded in managing to block most of their spawns, which means it can't spawn in a huge horde. It has to kind of trickle them in like this. Plenty of magnum rounds doesn't really matter. So, 
while we're just waiting for the night to end here, the, the plan is going to be I want to go out on a journey as we do. And uh, we're going to take the bare necessities for food, water, uh, medical supplies for when I inevitably get attacked and bit and all that. Of course, this one does. We're going to take the truck. We're going to go to a uh, nearby town. Um, I think we'll start just because the, the desert has a lot of birds. We'll start by going to this town here. And we'll just try to survive a day in this town. Without, like, taking shelter, without trying to be sneaky, just going around, running around the town, and, and surviving. And we'll leave the jeep in, like, a centralized area, in case we need to get back there to survive. Uh, but we'll just kind of see what happens. And it also means we see a demolisher around a bunch of other zombies. We can just shoot the demolisher and have them blow up and kill zombies for us. So we don't have to worry about, uh, you know, our base getting destroyed because of the demolisher or anything. It was just completely free range, so it will help us, but also kind of make us have to run around a lot. But with max stats, we might be able to do it since we, um... How do you just pass right the fuck out? But with max stats, we'll be able to do it because I think uh, using stamina to run around doesn't really do much now. It goes down, like, very slowly. So as long as we manage to, uh, aim and stuff properly here... Really pretty good. I'm going to take some wood though. Get some frames. Let's get just I'm gonna get 500 frames. I finally have a few zombies here. I wonder how uh, I wonder where they're coming from. goal is to kind of travel lightly, and by lightly I mean we're just going to carry ammunition and a bare minimum of medical supply in case we need them, and then the truck is going to carry some extra medical supplies, food, water, and plenty of ammunition uh, for when we go around. And I think each night we'll kind of rotate around. First we'll start uh, in this town, then we'll go to this town, um, then we'll try to go to this town. And then, we can kind of end up in this town there. And we'll just kind of survive in the way for so I'm for as long as we can. That's what we have. And see if, uh, we can survive or not. And when we die, we'll end seven days. That's kind of the plan there. Because at this point in the game, we have all the knowledge we really need. We don't have anything that can be that uh, is irreplaceable, you know. Move those over there. I have to throw this wood back up there. I was thinking about bringing turrets and like. All I could do is just sort of set up in a crossroad for the night and have like a kind of a circlement of shotgun turrets, right? But after cons after some consideration, I decided not to do that because I'd have to bring a land flame block as well if I wanted to pick up the uh, generator bank. So that was the ideal. Close, aren't you, sir? Anymore. I'm gonna 
not bikers are the, the big guys. I can pretty much take them down in one shot here. Oh, lover guys. I'll just use the Magnum for now. And remember, the hordes last until 10 uh, a.m. So. I mean, kind of for now. Maybe we'll reach level 300 before we uh, call it a day. There's a demolisher. You know what? I'm going to shoot him in the chest. Maybe not. I don't keep my base alive for posterity to save. In case I ever decide to kill him and play seven days again, I can just load back in. And use this, uh, this lovely base. Expand it a little more, you know? Two nine nine. I'm here for two nine nine. I don't think we're gonna hit uh, three hundred tonight, but we will definitely hit three hundred today. But today I mean streaming day. Uh, Remember, each day is thirty minutes, which means since we have twelve hour hordes, um, it's gonna be about uh, fifteen minutes of daylight to. Recover from the previous day that we're getting owned on, and then uh, after that, we'll have basically 15 minutes of running around trying to survive. Minute days. Um, I'd be 30 minutes divided by 24 hours. Yeah, gives us 1.25 uh, minutes per in-game hour. Yeah, right. I do quite love the Magnum. It is quite nice. There's nothing like normie zombies like them. Even if they're fatal, they go down in one shot, which is just excellent. The radiated ones, the uh, chonkier boys, of course, take a couple more shots, but that's kind of how it is sometimes. Recoil's insane when you're not aiming down the sides, though. In terms of the little kick that it gets when you're aiming, the, uh, the hip fire is just... looks like a Bronco. Alright, we got about... Minute 15 seconds left. Be done with Horde Knife here. Then we'll have 15 minutes to get together our gear, get to the city we're going to be staying in this night, prepare to survive. Hmm. 
I'll just magnum ammo. I don't need any of this stuff. I think we might be done. Judging by the fact that there's no zombies coming, we'll just give it another little bit here. We'll just wait until actually 10 rolls around. And I'll go ahead and turn this generator off and we'll go ahead and get together our gear. Alright, while well, it's doing that, let's make sure our guns are loaded here. Reload this. Okay, we're done. Generator off. And then uh, let's go ahead and grab this fuel as well. Alright, out we go. Oh, dang. Dropped a uh, food bag up here, huh? Wait, that means something got up here. They do that. Oh, well. Oh, that's how. Which means they, uh... They broke through somewhere down here? Yeah? What did they do? What's broken? They didn't break through the door. So they, they came through here to get up to me. Where'd they do that at? They didn't walk up through here. They didn't go through here. Oh. That makes sense, I guess. Yeah, so they, uh, they decided to climb up here to get to me, huh? And then, uh, yeah. Okay, well, anyway, let's go to the truck real quick. We'll unload what we currently got and get ready to go. So, we already have some water, medical supplies, all that good jazz. Let's go ahead and put in our, our gasoline here. We don't need this much. That's whatever. I'm going to keep two, three stacks of tokens just in case we need, like, emergency stuff there. Let's go ahead and throw in our shotgun shells. Then I'm going to go ahead and do this. Ah, come on. Not that. Now we got a nice roll of that. And then for the magnum rounds, I'll do that. Toss out this stack that's kind of dead there. I'm going to move these down because I don't need that magnum rounds. Next, we got our AP ammunition, which I'm going to go ahead and toss in here like that. Perfect amount. And let's go ahead and toss in our normal pistol rounds. This, excellent. And then the 762 can live here. Uh, go ahead and just take the air tools, put them there. Pack that up. All right, perfect. Let's go get, we need food, medical supplies, and more ammunition. We pretty much have one of every main medical supply in there. At this point, I'm just looking to get uh, at least one more stack. So we'll get a boot here, get some vitamins, we'll get uh, the rest of our antibiotics, um, get another kit there. I think that's all that we need. Yeah? All the medical supplies there. Okay. Next, let's, uh, first of all, let's turn this off, because we're not going to... Actually, it's done? Wait, no, I was making 14 of these. Did it glitch and delete all my gunpowder? Wow. I need to see it. Okay, so what what water do we want to bring? Um, that's obviously 24 and stamina regen. That's a little bit less stamina regen, but you also get the digestive thing there. So I think I'll take... We're going to grab three bottles of water here, uh, of tea. That'll help out. Also, yucca juice is actually not too bad for water, but never really have an issue with water, so that's a... Uh, we're going to bring our drone, just because our drone is perfect and, and lovely. Um, repair kits are forged iron and duct tape. Let's go ahead and take this, and we'll just make as many as we can real quick. And then I don't think I need anything else from this chest. Parts, I don't need any of this. Mods, don't need any of that stuff. Um, I guess I could bring along like a sniper rifle or something. Potentially. 
Hmm. Let's do that. Bring along the sniper rifle. Okay. And then uh, ammo materials. We don't need any of that. We need that stuff. We need that stuff. That. Um, we need food. So we'll go ahead and grab our tuna. And then these, of course, because they're pretty good. Uh, what else gives like a lot of stuff? Spaghetti is also really, really great. Uh, and then we have the gumbo. Uh, it's quite a lot. You know what? Let's just grab all the food that we have that's made. Uh, hope it's enough. It'll last us until we end up dying. All right. So after all of this, we need to bring with us ammunition. Um, Seven six two. Go ahead and bring all of this around. I'm gonna bring this AP ammo, and that's gonna be specifically for the sniper rifle. I'm just gonna bring all the 7.62 we possibly can. Right there. We'll just go ahead and gear this up. And then remember, we'll come back and forth till the truck's completely full. I don't wanna have anything wasted. All right, truck. Okay, so let's go ahead and we'll top off these. I can do that. That. Oh, water in here. The medical supplies in here. And did I not bring any tablets? I guess I didn't. An idiot, whatever. Uh, next, we'll go ahead and put in our food over here. Actually, maybe it wouldn't be bad to like eat this one, because I am a little hungry right now, and that'll free up a little bit of uh, space for Maybe this one too, I'll eat that. I kind of want to save as much space as possible. Yeah. Okay. So with that, we have that maxed out. I'm going to go ahead and do that. Alright, so let's go ahead and store in all of our normal 762 rounds. Perfect. Sort that real quick. And so that's all sorted and good. Um, we need to bring more shotgun shells. And then I think that would be pretty much all. Let's bring all the shotgun shells. So we need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven stacks of shotgun shells. Let's go grab those. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And one, two, three, five, six, seven, because I have a little extra there. So whatever. That's good. Anything else that I need to grab right now? I don't really need pistol ammo too much. Um, let's just bring the rest of the 762. Since we just have a bunch of it anyway. Is there anything else being produced in here? I'm just double check. Let's top off our, our personal stack of first aid kits. That all looks good. Didn't need anything from here. Uh, let's double check my stuff here. I'm going to go ahead and uh, repair my boots. Actually, I might as well just repair everything. Go ahead and cancel the uh, stuff there. I'll repair all that. Make all the repair kits. There's only two left, but still. That all should get up there, and we'll be maxed durability for all that, ready to go. It'll be beautiful. Uh, let's go ahead and also just repair the magnum one here. Okay, we got our shotgun shells. We've got, uh, let's grab uh, two more stacks of shotgun shells, actually. Now we will have a little extra for the uh, shotgun while we're around. And then let's just fill up the rest of our equipment with pistol rounds. Okay, perfect. And yes, I know I left three uh, slots open there. That's for a reason. Then we'll get to that in a moment. All right, so let's go ahead and fill up this. All the shotgun rounds can go in here. Boom, boom, boom. done. All right. And then I'm gonna move this stuff here. Actually, fill up our stuff in there. Okay. Uh, I don't want that. I want AP rounds in this baby. Okay. Done. Perfect, perfect. Then it's all loaded. 
doesn't have any extra that in there. Okay, let's just make sure we are fully stacked up and ready to go. Good. Here. Okay. Looks good. So, a little extra space here. Get some stuff sorted real quick. Okay. We have all that. Let's go back and get a little more. I'm gonna get some, uh, another stack of magnum rounds. And then I'll fill the rest of the pistol in, then I'll grab the other three things that I was gonna grab here. One thing of magnum rounds, please. And grab this stuff here. Do I have nothing else that I want to get? Okay, perfect. All right, let's go. We're gonna grab the last little thing that I want to grab here. They have served me well. And I feel like having these could help turn the tide in a desperate situation. Could potentially have use of their service. So let's come on all of you. All right. Okay, okay. Door. All right, and with that, the truck is full. I am full. We can't really do much else right now other than get to our next destination, which is what we're going to be doing. Um, let's just take a look one more time, make sure everything's set up properly. It is. Okay. In that case, Drone Chan! Hello, Drone. Startup sequence activated. With that, I can go ahead and move this one down there, and I'll take another round, a couple rounds of this. And I know I could go back and get one more thing, but for now, it's not good. All right, come on, Drone Chan, let's go. We'll get to the city and figure out what we're going to do here tonight. It has been a little bit since we've been to the city, so... It is possible that we have to kind of figure out what we're doing. I'm just going to set a quick waypoint there so I have it on the map. So I know, oh, that's where the city's at. I right, just keep driving. Also, when we uh, do stop in the city, I'm going to have to rearrange my inventory my truck. I want to get the ammunition out. But not the ammunition. I want to switch some ammunition for some medical supplies. That way I have one of each medical supply in case I need it while we're out and about. I don't have to run back to the truck to get it. Okay. Town's real close now. Just over there. We're going to go this way. Go ahead and cut into here now. And while we're here, I'm going to do what I said. Uh, take some medical supplies. Let's start with getting rid of some of this pistol ammunition. Grab some of that. That. And then... Antibiotics. There we go. Okay, perfect. Now... Find out what we're setting up. So we previously had a house, um, I think it was that one right there, like kind of in the basement, uh, holding up, right? But I don't want to be like in a house. I want to be like roaming around the city at night. Um, so I want to find places we can like jump off of and climb up and have like pathways through the city, you know? If we flip the map, um, I do remember there were over here, kind of at the end there was that place called the Bear's Den, and then also way past here was a warehouse district with a bunch of different stuff in it, right? So, if we need to, we could potentially like run through some of these places and whatnot. I think we might start the Horde Night in that building. I mean, just so shit, it's a bear. Damn it. 
That's not good. Um. Yep. I got the, uh... I'm gonna leave my car. I think I'll leave it right about here. And right, let's start the Fortnite down here. Like I said, in this building. We will, uh... Let me go in here already. Clearing it up a bit. I've got a bad feeling about this. Okay, and if I remember correctly, there's a guy here and a guy here. Not dead yet, though. Okay. We don't have very long until the, uh, the horde actually comes, so. What's in here? Iron Torch is dead. Use this opportunity to start sneaking around up here. And, uh, I'll try to do is I'm gonna try to snipe some things uh, until we run out of ammunition. Oh, oh it's got a sni silence arrive, too. And so the horde's coming, so it should be spawning uh, somewhere around me. And they'll definitely be trying to get up here or smash their way into me. So. Kill him. Got him. You can definitely hear the, uh, the zombies down there. And uh, it's not a good sign. They're definitely coming up. Let's see if I can figure out where they're at down there. If I could, like, get some shots on them. Kill some of them down here. Birds, of course. I right, love this. So annoying. Like an all you can shoot buffet down here. God damn. real quick okay they really want to get get to me here don't they real quick get some of these uh, irradiated boys out of the way but ammo does penetrate so if I hit them here do a multiple damage to all of them. As do I, drone champ. We got. Let's reload this so we have all the ammo in here. Okay, one bullet left. Get him? Okay. Oh, oh 50,000 from that. Nice. We have them group up and use the last of the rockets. They're grouping right there. Anywhere else, y'all? Huh? It's an okay grouping, but not a lot of them. Right? There's some dogs. Nice AOE on that one too, perfect. Okay. A lot back there, but a lot of slamming right there. Oh, 25,000. Nice. Alright, last rocket. Look at those guys. And, uh, I'm just gonna bring that. Enjoy the rocket launcher losers. Since if I uh it's just a yellow one anyway, so it doesn't matter too. All right, now, let me repair this. We're not repairs, reload this. 
So we're topped off on ammunition here. Uh, AP rounds are down. Um, all right. Ready, y'all. Let's go. Come on, losers. Let's go. Oh, here they come. Maybe now I should have like, left the uh, rocket launcher for now when they all came out of there, right? I'm trying to get up here. Sure. Uh, I can jump even higher, though. Well, no, I can't. Never mind. Here, I can jump across there, though, if I need to. Look at all of them. That's a lot of weight to right there. For a rocket launcher. As soon as you use it up, you, you see all a bunch of places that like, man, it's gonna be great. Oh, oh god, it's in that car. Uh oh, it can uh, do a little bit of damage here, huh? I think if I were to have the trunk underneath me shot out, I might fall down and get surrounded by it. Not good. Oh crap, hey. Birds will let you sneak up on you, don't they? I think right here, that's going to be going in this little area here, so. I have abrasion on my leg, it looks like. Not good. Lower my max health. Remember, the drone can heal me. So, she's good to have. Let's break that. Perfect. Okay. Switch to the uh, LMG here. We'll flatten some of them here. The LMG is easier to get ammo rid of too because there's just so much of it. Did I just take damage from that? Oh, man. Okay. Flashing of the lights kind of sometimes looks like damage indicators here, so. Okay, let's go ahead and move on to the next building. Um, where's the next building at? Right here? Oh. Can't get up on there yet. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Um, go on top of here. Can I jump across? Nope. Incoming okay. enemies. Yep, I know. I know. I think I can get up here if I do it properly. There we go. Woohoo! That was a close one. I can kind of go around here and uh, I feel like zombies are definitely going to come in and get me here, uh, which is not ideal. Entrance. I'm gonna be like flanked before I can even know where they're coming from. If it wasn't so dark out, I'd be able to be like, oh yeah, so they're all coming from here. Um, quite hard to see what's going on in this particular building. I think I might move to a different one. One outside of this fence and go. Come on, zombies, let's go! I know it's Allie. <laughs> Look, we're sprinting and we're not even using up any stamina. It's, it's brilliant. Look, there's my truck. I need to bail. Oh my god, this would be perfect for the rocket launcher. Holy shit. Kind of blind fire right now. Gotta reload, let's keep running. I mean, at this point, I'm not even losing stamina. I can literally just keep running for days. 
not lose. Oh god. Hit a wall. Oh god. For a little distance. One thing that's not good is that they are irradiated. So it's a lot harder to kill them uh, because they just regenerate their health. Reload while we get some distance here. Thin out the, the little zombies, the minor ones that aren't irradiated. And, uh, pretty good job here. So let's, let's loop around here. God, the rocket launch would have been so good here. Come on. Why am I not hitting the demolisher when I'm shooting at him now? The one time I want to hit the Demolisher, it's, it's not hitting him. It's ridiculous. Where'd he go? There he is. You really just gonna die? Howard. Nope, he's not dead yet. Let's... Got him. Nice. Oh god, they're all coming down. Well, I got a good chunk of them there, I think. Uh, at least that hole, that's an indication. Quite a bit of them. Got about four minutes left. It was reload. And get onto this roof here. Made it. Let's just mow them down now. Come on, y'all. Yeehaw, baby, come on. Can they get onto the roof from here somehow? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Try to get through that little gap. All y'all. Oh, they can. They can get onto the roof. Accidentally killed that bird. Let's uh, let's try to run through here and bait them to all kind of group up down this little corridor. Fuck, it's broke. Gun's broke. It's gonna be kind of hard to uh, repair it here. Hold on. Repair. Aha! I got it off. Hell yeah. Okay. Penetrating slugs right now. This would be over in like minutes. Come on, take the demolisher. Ah. Come on, hit him, hit him. There we go. Oh, oh I'd love to see it. You think? Have they? Have your senses picked something up? Perfect. Another bunch of guys just went down. Love to see it.
Coming at me. Oh. I think that the drone might be doing more harm than good because it's blocking my vision a lot. Not gonna get him away. Fuck, sir. I can't tell if I'm doing like anything to these guys. There's so many bikers just chilling here. Let's run back past the turret. Knock some of them down. One right next to me. Oh, lady. Good. Crap. Grab I'm not carrying AP rounds right now. Sports fans are starting to destroy property over there for no reason. So you guys do team lows, huh? Is that what you're destroying the light post over there, huh? Alright, let's go. Mission accomplished. Move on to the next area. We survived the horde night. I'm not gonna clean up because that's just a bunch of bikers and stuff that absorb dots. Point. Now we could, since we're going back to the north, we could honestly restock our supplies um, at home and whatnot before we go to the, the desert city above. We could consider doing that. So uh, tonight did not turn out exactly how I planned. Uh, I was planning to go like through building this stuff, but. I quickly decided, given the size of the horde and whatnot, uh, and the fact that all the buildings there were pretty, pretty tight, that it might not be the best idea to do that. Uh, if I even get stuck for like a second, hundreds of zombies would be on me. That's not good. Well, not hundreds, probably like dozens. In fact, that only 62 or 64 can be alive at a time for the horde, but, uh, Still. I'm gonna go ahead and pick up this airdrop to see what it is. It's probably gonna be nothing, but you never know. Maybe it could be something like a bunch of rockets or something. I don't know. Wouldn't that be just interesting? Yep. It's just armor, which we're gonna go ahead and drop that. And... I don't care. So, thinking about it, maybe stopping by home be kind of breaking the rules and the decision you can make. Go on a journey. But we will stop on this relatively safe area so I can uh, interact and work some stuff out here. So looking at our ammo consumption, we didn't really go through too much. We did go through um, a stack, 160 to be exact, shotgun shells. So that's not bad. Um, I'm going to go ahead and use a first aid kit from our thing here. Just get rid of that abrasion. That. Perfect. And then uh, we are a little bit hungry, so let's go ahead. I'm going to eat this hobo stew. Another airdrop, by the way. And then I think I'll also eat one of these silly dogs. Where's the airdrop at? Oh, it's actually up that way. We can actually go get that before night falls. Okay, and it looks like in terms of 
762 we used quite a bit because that's what we were mainly focusing on here was the 762 i'm gonna put my sniper rifle away i'm not gonna try to use that right now i think that's the last 762 so i'll take that Okay. Not bad, not bad. Well, let's go ahead and also I'm going to repair my, my auto shotgun because that's in a pretty bad condition. Thing with the uh, SMG, but I think that's enough for a pass there. Put these boys out. Anything else that I want to do real quick? Maybe take a sip of the, uh, the lovely up here. There we go. Okay. Roll, get that airdrop, and then pick a place in town that will be staying the night. So the, the demolishers definitely helped out to thin the herd last night when we shot them in the chest. It's just, it looks like it's that flashing charge on their chest that you gotta hit. Which seems wrong, because I swear to god I've shot them elsewhere and they've started to attack me, but perhaps that's just because I've been trying to not get them to detonate that everywhere else appears to work. Oh, what the hell? Multiple airdrops over here? I mean, I'm not gonna say no to free airdrops. What we got here? Pops and melee mods, don't care. Like I said, it'd be super stellar if we could find like a, a airdrop that just had, I don't know, millions of rocket frag rounds in it, that'd be great. I, for one, would thank our overlord who is dropping airdrops. Steel. Actually, you know what? Um, where did the steel go? Where did I drop it at? What the hell? I know I dropped it, but... Oh, there it is. I'll save that forged steel. Like, I might not be... You know, going to use it. I'll just jump on top of you if you're gonna freaking. Oh, apparently it doesn't work. Never mind. Well, let's just get off the hill then. And I'll save the forged steel for when I could possibly uh, come back to seven days and use it. Please don't get stuck between these two resources. Okay, now that we're on a level field, let's go ahead and get that forged iron out of our inventory here. Right there, and let's go ahead and grab. All the pistol rounds we can take as well. I didn't notice there was a skull on the side of this uh, gun. Very neat. Okay. We have 3,000 762 rounds to get through. Will it be enough to get us to the burnt city or not? I guess it depends on how much I use the gun. All right, so we have a little time here. Plan what we're doing. Um, ideally, somewhere that has roof access would be good to find. Uh, I guess a lot of places do. It just depends upon how you want to get to them. But let's check this uh, this shop real quick. Maybe we can find some books to buy or something. I'm just gonna check. We're not gonna get any. I'm not gonna waste time getting tokens if there's nothing. Here. Oh, this wasteland is full. A guy can have it too much. Sometimes you have plenty of bandages. What? This is a uh, weaving plant fibers into cloth. Needles and thread four is tank tops and such. Tempered blade schematic. Of course, he has a bunch of stuff that I can like use now. A solar blank bank, really. Well, let's go grab a stack of tokens. I'll go ahead and buy that stuff quick. Change that for a stack of tokens. Oh, wait, I can't do that. I need to get some free space. Sorry. Four should be enough there. Might also buy any like special like AP rounds or anything he has. All right. Go there, sir. Go ahead and buy that. Buy that, buy that, just so I can learn. You know how it is, sir. Um, right, do you have anything else here? 
that I could use for my journey. Heal things. AP Magnum rounds. God dang, sir. Intense. I think I'll pass though. Um, I might buy some pipe bombs though. That's pretty cool. I can use some pipe bombs. Oh my god, he has a single Thanks rocket. Come again. I say that like I still have a rocket launcher, like I didn't just throw it off the edge um, of a building. I was like, I don't need this. I'm out of rockets now. Sort of idiot. Okay, let's grab our 762 back. Nice. Okay. Let's continue looking for where we're going to hold out here. So we could potentially get on top of that tank there. Try to hold out. That'd be nice. Well, the church would be a spooky place to hold out. It's got walls. But, uh, not necessarily that great. There's a whole lot of stuff up the board still. I think it's mostly residential, though. So. Yeah. You know what? I'm actually kind of feeling that tank that we saw. Let's go scout that out a little bit. Because it leaves us exposed in the air. But, still pretty cool, right? Because the zombies will have to, like, run up here, yeah? Which even I'm having a hard time doing. And then... They get here... Is this just, like, the inside of the tank? Master, we are not alone. If I'm aware... Oh my god, so they can attack either through here or come up the staircase, huh? That is spooky. I like it. Can I close this? Oh, it's locked? Damn. If that was not locked and I can close it, this would be absolutely perfect. Like, if I have the time to just, like, go through this hatch and place down my own hatch, Although I don't have anything to make a hash with. I do have a block though. Maybe I can place down a block. Oh no, better idea. Better than smashing through that. Why don't I destroy the ladder? Genius. If I destroy the ladder, then they won't be able to climb up here. We'll have to use the other stairs. Perfect. Yeah. Be sure I'll remove uh, another layer of it here. Okay, perfect. Now I just gotta be careful to fall in there. So if I do go in there, there's no way out. So, uh, yeah. In fact, um, can I put this here? Darn. How about here? Then there. Here we go. That's the play. Okay. Where can this guy get? Because if I could put them, like, right here, maybe, would it be able to punch off this? Is that possible? Is such a thing possible? What if I destroy this? Is he using your noodle? Stamina's not even going down. That is great. I'm not sure I can attack through the bar, but if I get rid of this. Here we go. So now it should be able to attack right there, yeah? If I put another one here, it'll just kind of kick them off. It'll be hilarious. 
Can I get another one somewhere? Maybe I'll just put another one, like, right. I don't know. I think that's fine. What I can do is, while they're coming up, I can just kind of hose them down here. And, uh, if they try to, like, jump from there up to here, the, uh, the turret, it'll try and knock them down. If they get up through here, it'll do that too. And then I have this thing back here, which they can't get up. So as long as they don't uh, decide to get in through the bottom and attack that supporting thing, which is the only thing supporting the entire structure, I think we should be good. Because if that collapses, then we are screwed. But luckily, if we need to, I should be able to just jump off of this and land on the car to uh, very safely, yeah, just like this. I'm actually gonna get it a little closer, just like so I have to jump off too badly. But that, okay. This will work perfectly. All right. Let's see how this goes. Will the zombies be able to make it up the spiral staircase? Or will they die? Speaking of spiral staircases, is that an option for me to build? Oh my god, it is. I can just build a straight-up spiral staircase. This can be good reference for later. Um, like future seven days. Because if they are having an issue getting up the spiral staircase, I could use that to make a base as a spiral staircase. And uh, it could be interesting. Let's see what happens today. It was a little bit different than what we did last time, last night at the other city. Uh, also, is a desert city, so it's whatever. Once we get over to this city, I think there's some skyscrapers, or at least some like uh, larger areas we can mess around in uh, at night. That'll be interesting. And then definitely when we go to the Wasteland City, it's going to be the hardest one for us to deal with. There are large structures there. It's just a matter of... Do we want to risk them? Because the last time we went to one of those, um, the popping pills there wrecked our, our whole day, our whole life. All right. Here we go. It's boogie time. My Another senses one. have picked up something. Come from over here. Okay, here it comes. The first zombies are trying to get up, but they don't seem to be able to figure out the spiral staircase, so they're actually attacking it instead of trying to go up it. Oh, there's one. One genius lady, but they're having a little bit of a hard time. Bird. The first one gets knocked off. Go ahead and light a pipe bomb, toss it down, and... Some damage right there. Nice, nice. Out of the sky, loser. They're definitely trying to get... What are we doing now? We're just sitting there like idiots. God, that red moon is just menacing, ain't it? Not a whole lot of them down there. I think their pathing might be a little bit screwed. By all this, oh crap! That is not ideal. Not ideal at all. Oh, they destroyed that ladder, so I can't get up there. Not the ladder, the, uh, the staircase. Look. Can I get on top of this? Yes, I can. Oh. Oh. I 
make it? I made it. Nice. I thought the drone was pushing me for a second there. Birds. Yeah, that's right. Try to get through that one little gap there, everyone. Perfect, 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 perfect. Do it. I don't know why they're attacking the fence. Maybe it's there, but okay. That's it. I'm gonna come through here. Let's go ahead and take this gap. Okay. Definitely confused about the spiral staircase. And now they're definitely confused about me being up here. Can I turn the lag a little bit though? It's not ideal. So it's reloaded, then we'll do that. And go. <laughs> Having some issues here. I'm gonna jump. Oh god. Every while it's lagging is not ideal. Um, let's just run away real quick. I want to get back up there to get my spirit uh, boys. But there's just so many zombies around that I just can't pull them off. I see a dog in the pack here. here. Learn another one. <laughs> can they get up here to me? I think if they use this place right here they can. We're gonna put my last turret here. Let's see if we can you know Bastards! You get up here, bud. Oh, that's how. Makes sense. The way that I thought you would come. I figured my turret would be able to bash him down, though. Roof is now no more. Oh, one turn, we gotta go. Hoopa. Come. <laughs> that might not have been a good use of him, but 
Forgot him. Okay, can I get up here? Come on. Let me up. Let me up! Demolisher down there. We hopefully use him to cut off some of these guys down there. If I get lucky. Oh, they just destroyed that fence. Kind of root of them. Ah. And he's running away now. Damn. Another demolisher there, though. Can I get it? Can I get it? Can I get it? I got it. Blow up, sir. Nice. Good job, wasn't it? Alright. They're all going to be missing around down there. Which means they might actually start attacking. I think they're starting to attack the, uh, the middle support beam there. Try to get around to this side near the car in case we have to make a quick jump exit. I wish I could more easily see down what they're doing. There's that other demolisher you have. Can you really just run away, like way, way, way far away, or you do. Um something else out. Let's go. There he is. Later, haters! Oof. The lag is not good here. Is it this room that has the ladder? Yep, we gotta go around. Oop. Come on, get up. God, I'm lagging so hard. Let's, let's pause for a second here to contain the, uh, the lag. Yep, moving on. Fuck, that's not good. That's the opposite of good, actually. Boop! Boop! <laughs> Fuck. Now I can just do this. There's this little trunk. Get absolutely nothing that I need or want. I guess I'll take this 762 ammo. Okay, now I have an escape out. Keep her out. Yeah, he's, he's telling me there's a paper in right now. Surprising the sturdy. Calm down, boys. Let's go. I haven't actually really shot many zombies this night. Makes me a bit nervous. What are they attacking here? Oh, 
gold. Ah, that was too early, damn it. We go to begin. Oh, what's that? So far, it seems it's surprisingly easy to survive Fortnite in just a random place. Assuming you have high ability to run away and jump. So if you get parkour and... What's the other one that, like... Is it Sexual Tyrannosaurus? Unless you, like, run a lot? You basically just outrun any zombie. Like, no big deal. Okay. They're trying to get up to me. But uh, they're not having a good time of it, looks like. Master, we are not alone. Yep, I know, lady. A lot of guys down there, looks like. Let me see if I can get some of them out. Look at that slab there in there. Yes, I can. Oh, hey! Oh, God. Oh, let me go. Uh, I guess they were attacking through the roof. Ah, you can see a couple of them up there on the rooftop. My car, no! How dare you all just run through my car like that? It's so freaking rude. Survive another horn night, nice. I've got a bad feeling about this. Go. Let's run back this way because I'm tired of hearing that. Noise. Oops. 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 All right, let's finish off this horde since it's pretty small. Just like that, we survived another horde night. Alright, let's repair our guns here. And let's reload and make sure everything's good here. I'll take the 762 rounds. Nicely done. A beautiful night, if I do say so myself. We uh, almost had to abandon our turrets, but luckily for us, today was not that day. We managed to survive by running around. Like insane people. That was quite profitable for us. Yes, yes. All right. Let's search this last bag, get in the truck, and continue on our way. Nothing there I want. Actually, while we're safe, it wouldn't be a bad idea to put through our stuff and eat a little bit because we are hungry here. So, eat this last chili dog, and then. 
Okay, so we start on the sham. Leave two of the shams just to that. And drop these. Perfect. And then I think we're good on everything else. Perfect, perfect. Okay, let's go ahead and grab some more shotgun shells. We'll grab more of the pistol rounds here. Kind of fill out everything. All right. We are two nights down from our four night journey towards the wasteland. Now all we have to do is get across to this city, figure out where we're going to set up shop, and uh, prepare for the next night. See how it goes. Now we are running quite low on supplies right now. In terms of ammunition, we have like a bunch of AP ammunition for the, the SMG. But what we need to do is we need to be careful not to run out of ammo for everything. Because what would really suck is if we were to only have one gun with ammo left when we hit the wasteland city. Because if we do that, then there's a chance that we'll end up having to repair the gun while we're fighting. Which is not good, because we know in the wasteland, Master, zombies constantly that. spawn at night. Not even just toward night, just a normal night. So it's definitely going to be a tough one for us to uh, survive in. We'll, we'll see what happens. For now, we could go set up in this area. If we clear it out today, we would have a very strong fortress, basically, for the horde. And plenty of area to run around in as well. However, let's get deeper in the city. I think it could be fun to try to do it further in the city where it's like up, right? Otherwise, it's just being in a walled area, you know, whatever. Like, it's not like. Last time was pretty fun. The first night that we were like, out and about running around, it wasn't all that great because we were, you know, just kind of messing around running around the street, literally. So, that didn't help too much. So, looking at this, we have a construction site, a skyscraper, three-story, four-story building, five-story? One, two, three, four, five, six, kind of the roof. Uh, there's that modern art thing over there. Okay, so we have a, we have a church, we have this construction site, we have a bunch more like, tall buildings in this direction. There's the cracker book that we uh, started to bring down. Good stuff, good stuff. Oh my god, a parking garage? Pretty crazy. What is this place with the American flag over here? Post office, yeah? Okay, okay. Dance till you die, studio. Okay, well, go ahead and run into that because I'm an idiot, and then just go down here. We got a good number of places that we could try to survive here. Not bad, to be honest. Um, let me zoom out here real quick. We're just south of that road. There we go to the other place. I think that's a dead end there. Okay. We've got a church, a number of skyscrapers, and a construction site that are prime targets for us to live in. I'm going to turn around again here. Okay. La Spank. Okay. Master, we are not alone. That part's nice. Joe Bros Builder. Next to a pizzeria. Ooh. I remember that church being like quite large as well. Um 
we could potentially go up to the bell tower try to survive up there with zombies coming after us that wouldn't be a bad idea and if it gets overrun we can just kind of evacuate over to this building which is uh isn't that bad i guess is what that place is called let's back up into this alley here we're good we're locked and loaded so let's go ahead and get into the church. Go ahead and just use that. Might as well drink a little something. Okay. So is there... I'm sure the front entrance is barred, right? But with the shotgun... What do you mean? Ah, 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 ah. Get out of here. Grass down. Oh, got a hole there. My senses have picked up something. You don't say. Works, I guess. All right, so we wanted to go to the bell tower. Get rid of that stuff. Um, here we go. We have some birds up here, if I remember correctly. So, careful of that. There's one. Moving on. Okay, we can go and cross over here. Cross that. Jump into here. And we have the bell tower. Nice and secured all to ourselves here. Excellent. We can also search it and see if there's any good loot up here. Which there's probably not. Oh, there's some yucca juice. I can drink that a little bit later after night goes. Hardened chest has... I guess that. Some ammunition for us, too. I'll, I'll take some of that. Working stiff box with nothing. Country with nothing. A weapon bag that's in the ground. Ooh, an M60 that's purple. Damn. It's hard to see that. Well, this looks like it's going to be our current base of operations for right now. That's cool. Hey, Drone Chan, can you come over here? A little bit further away from there? So we should be able to see them entering the church and uh, trying to get up here very nicely. Right? Pat, 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 pat. Robotic Drone Mobile Booster. Hmm. All right. Now we just uh, wait a little bit here until the enemies come. Also, what I could do is down here. I don't think the zombie going to cross this, to be honest. I'm going to place this here, though, just in case they can. I will punch them off. Hilarious. I think for the most part, they're not going to be able to get up here. Which uh, works for me, to be honest. But we'll see what happens. It'll just bonk them off. And then I can uh, I'll use the magnum for a bit here. To beat some people up. And if we have to abandon that turret, it's not the end of the world. Because it is just a level 1 turret. We can make level 5 now. So it, it really doesn't matter. But for now, we're just going to wait until night falls. And we're going to see what is the hip happening. Because, uh, who knows what's going to happen with, uh, zombies here, you know? We'll just kind of take a look and see what's going on, you know?
Incoming enemies, prepare for conflict. Where? No one's coming up the stairs. I like guess it's impossible. Also, let me talk to you. Great to see you, Master. That's your inventory? Oh my god, you can carry stuff for me too, I forgot. Um. It is a pleasure to serve. I have to heal my allies. How may I assist you? Or heal only me. I can't tell if it's healing me or what it's doing. Like, because if it's healing me, it's not healing very fast. So, yeah. Kind of a thing. But we'll see what happens. This Horde Knight could be interesting. I mean, there's literally one way to get up to me unless they, like, destroy the church and just climb up, like, around or something. Which could potentially be a thing. You know, the church wouldn't actually be all that bad of a place to hold out, you know? Like, you repair the roof and whatnot, you have a good area, and you can see, like, a ways around for the horde to snipe them. And if you set up stuff to, like, slow them down, like, little walls or stuff like that, you usually get a bunch of snipe stuff off there. And the fact that it has, like, a second story around the uh, middle you could use to fire downwards at them. Just put them on your feet, okay? Pretty good. So. Yeah. Anyway. Wow. It, uh... It feels like the first night that we went out, and the second night we went out, we had, like, barely any time before the night came. But now we have, like, all this time. I guess it's, like, pretty close by. Even that's pretty close by, right? Okay. I don't know. Weird. I'm just kind of... Wait for another hour, though. Another minute, I guess it would be, you know? That's just a weird texture, I think. I was wondering if I could destroy the Aka Messiah thing over there. Sign, but. Don't think, uh. That's the range. Hmm. Alright. Fortnite starts in 10, 9, Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and let Horde Night begin. <laughs> it is time. Now, so where are they coming from? First of all, the question. Is it from directly over that way or from that way? Maybe I just close this. It just doesn't say to precaution. Church door is open, y'all. What are you doing? There's some zombies. The first, first indication. I've got a bad feeling about this. Okay. First kill. Oh. Is it trying to attack from up above? Up here they come! It's so hard to see from here though. Let's go down there. That way I'm a little bit closer down here and I can see better. I can kill that bird. Yep. I'm 
abrasion? Are you kidding me here? There's another bird. Where'd it go? It's dead. I think there's another bird. Well, let's go ahead and use this uh, for tape kit to fix that abrasion real quick. It should be coming up here at any time now. The ladder's right there. So it should be trying to come around this area. Oh, someone oh, got on the roof. A couple of them got on the roof. Hey guys, I think they're actually going to try to run up here. Master, we yeah. are not alone. I'm going to go. Back up top side. Yeah, bully him, bully him off. Reload the SMG I've quick. Still getting bullied outside. I hear the thunk of my uh turret out there pounding away at him. The birds are kind of stupid. They don't seem to be uh Wait, if you do that, you guys aren't gonna be able to get up here. You guys realize that, right? If you guys attack that ladder, you won't be able to get up here. That's right, fall down. I feel their bodies just roll out of the window and fall to the ground again. Congratulations, you guys now can't get up to me. Bird screeching at me is getting kind of annoying though. PBH. now huh a lot of guys down below uh let's actually just drop down all right come on turret chant let's go backing out of here 
get to this part of the roof. So we can see where they're coming from. Look, the roof might be messing with the tapping a little bit. I've got a bad feeling about this. Bad time to reload, I guess. She's dead for good now. Crap. Put a little distance between us and the zombies here. Oh, there's nowhere to run that way. Oh, over here. Oh. Oh, I got infected, but that's okay. Sometimes that happens. Okay, I can't get on top of that, it looks like. Can I get here? Yes. Okay, I can. Let's reload while we have a second. Maybe uh. I like that they keep falling like right there. Kind of funny. Here we go again. We'll have a second. All right. Light lag, it's uh, making it a little bit harder to shoot people. What are you guys attacking that wall for, huh? I'm gonna go down. Could be risky, but at the same time, it could be fun. If I get a clear shot on him. Come on, it's buckshot, dude. I'm hitting you with buckshot. Surely it's hitting your thing. Got it. A little bit late, but I got it. No, come on. Hit, hit. Turn your chest to me and stop moving. Piece of shit. so hard to hit when you want to hit it. Why is it so hard to hit when you want to hit it? I'm 
off anymore. Unfortunate. I like how wherever I go, there's just like a trail of destruction of buildings following me. I'm hungry now? I don't think I have any food on me right now. Wait, why am I not taking the antibiotics that I have? I forgot I had all my stuff in my on my person right now. Where did the other demolisher go? Oh, I want to go ahead and just shoot this. Give myself a nice, non-steep platform to sit on. That section. That'd be cool if it could, though, huh? Okay, well, I think we've done pretty much all we can here. Uh, where's my car at? Where's my car? Dude, where's my car? That's supposed to be it, right? Yeah, okay, there it is. I'm just blind. Don't worry about me. Oh! Nailed it. Perfect. Absolute perfection. Come on, hit it, hit it, hit it, son of a bitch. No! I'm sure he did after he died. It's a shame. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Come on. Where are you going? At least now everyone's kind of grouped together and I can do this. Die, you sons of bitches! Ah. Okay. Reloading! I would love to get a demolisher to just blow up so like. Get a bunch of kills, but I'm sure you're chesting me. Yeah. Let's go ahead and just get out of here. Oops. Don't crouch. Don't crouch, please. Time to go. All right, so next, we're going to hit up this uh, main road on the far uh, west here. Take it south into Wasteland City. See if we can find a place for us to make our own. Main road 
should be one more past in this road, so I'm just out we come through here. Right, now that we're at a relatively safe area, let's go ahead and sort through our gear here. Uh, make sure everything's reloaded. My senses have picked up something. Hell? Did I, did I park on top of that thing? Let's just make sure we have all of our gear there. Go ahead and repair the LMG, and then... Alright. We're quite hungry. Let's go ahead and I'm going to eat the tuna fish gravy. Also, we had a sham chowder just to cap that off there. Perfect. Okay, let me grab that. Toss that away. Also, might as well eat this red tea. Alright, next up. Fill our inventory as usual. Put the pistol rounds. Perfect, let's go. Now we just go south until we hit the Wasteland City. And from there, we determine where we're going to spend the rest of our days. Pardon me. So it hasn't been too rough on us so far, but then again, uh, we did kind of just go on top of a church where the zombies couldn't really get to us and just kind of last the horde. So it was very simple. I mean, I guess take that as a, if you need a place to hide, just get to the top of that church and the zombies will basically not be able to get you once you destroy the ladder. And uh, you can pretty much chill there. You can even destroy the first ladder to get them up to the bell tower. And at that point, you're really secure. Because they're not going to be able to do much to you there. I'm actually going to remove my waypoint. So here's the traitor of the wasteland. Right at the top here. I'm not really going to talk to them or trade with them or anything. The question is, where are we going to make our stand at here? So there's a church there. And then we have a couple of shops around here. Um, all this good jazz. We have some industrial buildings over here. Uh, we have an industrial passive gas. Huh? Maybe we can go across this bridge here. You know what, I'm kind of curious about a place right here. It looks like that's open. Is there like a dungeon area in here? It's all locked up, but this area over here looks like it's not completely sealed. Oh my god, do we try to survive in the sewers? Holy shit, this would be perfect. Is there any way to get down here? Oh my god. This might be perfect. Hold on. Let's let's first of all Come on. Get up. Come on. The hell? Can't use the gun while I'm Come on, what, what the fuck is going on? Why am I, like, falling to the ground? Jesus Christ. This water is not okay. First of all. Let's go ahead and seal this off. That'll be nice. You see that guy over there? I'm gonna try to build a uh, 
walkway around here, I think. But it'll help me kind of get around this place. Hey there, you little shit. This could be a really good place to set up or a really bad place, depending upon how it, how it feels. Um, where's this go? This goes up to a parking garage structure. Honestly, not ideal that this is here, um, because zombies can just come in. So if we wanted to use this area, we'd have a way out, but also a way that zombies could flank us. I suppose we could try to go here, and then if I remove these blocks, the zombies might not be able to get to me. If I do that, I might be able to get away with this. As long as I don't attack this, I'm sure I'm fine. Yeah? It looks like they're trying to, like, go around somewhere, yeah. Like that. I've got a bad feeling here. about this. Can I, like, get out of this fucking water, please? Please? Okay, this place is fucking really, come on. Uh, yeah, this place is no, we're not doing this. This is bad, 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 bad news. We need to get out of here. Like, right now. We could just die right now. Uh, let's not do this at all. Let's get the hell out of here. We need to find a better place than this to set up shop. Because if we, uh... Hey, bud. Walk away from you. Truck! I need you, truck. It would have been a cool place if it, if it uh, would have been, like, deeper and had a more intricate interior. It could have been cool, but uh, yeah, not like that. We have a Savage Country store here. That building could be interesting. Oh my god, we have a shopping center? Hold on. I think this is the hospital, actually. Incoming enemies. Prepare for conflict. Oh god. There's a hell of a turn there. Okay, well... Let's check this building out. We have a little bit of time. Let's see what this structure is. That was already not a good, like, beginning to finding an area in this place. Alright, we have nice places to, like, jump at. Bears going up to different levels. I could like take position here and kind of shoot down there or jump up another level higher. How does it go? I could probably jump up there, yeah. Maybe not, but I don't want to risk that. Oh. But I think it wants me to go up here, yeah? Bird. And some ammo? Mm, I'll take that. Nom nom. Oh yeah. If this is broken up and just fits like this, I can I can definitely like see myself jumping around on the roof from place to place just to get like 
to an area that's much better. So, like if there's too many zombies over on this side, I can go to the next one, et cetera, et cetera. Oh yeah, that's, that's gonna be good. Okay, I think we'll do it here. There'll be plenty of places to like see zombies, kill zombies. Not. Right, okay. So right here, this is kind of like a, uh, so there's this here. Let's see, okay. Do that. Can I get rid of this uh, pile of rubble that's just kind of in the way? Jump over here. This is all here. Okay. So they could also be here. Okay, so it looks like if I was a zombie. They can't really... I don't think they can jump across this gap. They might be able to. What if I do this, though? Or move that piece. And this piece. Master, we are not alone. Yeah, I'm aware. So, they might be able to do that. Can I break off this piece at the end here? I think I can. There we go. Out of here. Alright. Yeah, if we do that... And I think the only way they can get across is that, and if we do... I'll find out what I All this. I might be able to get up that way, but I'm not entirely convinced. The only other way would be to jump across to there. So regardless, this place right here appears to have two ways of getting up to it. Which isn't bad. And luckily with my jumps, I can pretty much jump everywhere else. Yeah, yeah, it's looking good. Looking good. And with all the zombies clumping up to, like, get through the narrow expanses, it'll be nice. So, we'll hold up here and do that. So I think what I'll do is let's go ahead and put a pushy boy right here. That way they can get pushed off if they get up to this position. And let's also put one, like, right... Here. So if they climb up there, they'll also get pushed off. That looks good. And then are there any other other ways to get up to here? Not that I can see from there or from there. So I think we're good in terms of that. Um and I guess I can put a guy right here as well. I think we have picked up something. Got it. All right. All right. Okay, so we were holding out at. Um, I think my truck is over there. So if I need to, I should be able to jump from here and make it to the car without getting injured. That'll be a thing we can do. Make sure our guns are loaded. They're perfect. I'm going to try to use my... Uh, SMG as much as possible here, just to get through all this normal 7mm, uh, or 9mm, sorry. No egg. So if we need to, we could also potentially, we might be able to make that jump, to be honest. We might be able to. Like, it'd be rough, but we probably could. We could definitely make that jump now. So if we need to, this can be our, oh shit, we need to get out of here. Uh, halfway to get onto a different building. Widen it a bit so we can jump across there. We can definitely make that jump. Uh, so that'll be great. And here it comes. It is now Horde Night. Also, surprisingly, no zombies in this building, from what I could tell. Um, there was like, one or two that spawned there, yeah? Other than that, it was... Bleak and quiet. Alright, the zombies know where I'm at. They're gonna start trying to come to me. Um... 
Okay, watch out for birds. How are we looking here? I don't see anyone yet. It's the second zombie I've seen. They've all been running in that way. I'm curious where they're going. Another one? I've got a bad oh. feeling about this. Here it comes. What? Someone just got pushed. Which turret did it? Did it did it push a bird? I think it pushed a bird. Did you push a bird for me, turret? You're a bird. Because of that. There it is. Alright. Where are they at? They haven't, like, made any progress towards me. Nope. Try to get a different position. Get over here, and then I can kind of see where they're all running to. They're all... Looks like they're trying to get up here. Let's go to the top before you do some bile at me. They're trying to jump across from there, but failing? I'll use it to my advantage and take some of y'all out. Why are you guys jumping that way, though? It's so ridiculous. All you guys have to do is get to there. How do they do that? Can I not walk across that? Am I too secure again? Can I shoot that wall? Ooh, damage. Come on. Oh my god, they were all built up right there, huh? God dang. Look at them all just spilling out. I have to kind of demolish her and I can take them to get these guys in the grave. Ah, dang. Put them all down there. I'm gonna break this. I don't like having that there. It uh, kind of sketches me out a little bit. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the party. I'm gonna get off this now. A little bit sketchy for my taste. Let's go ahead and kill this cluster down here if we can. I'm getting the slightest hints of lag right now. I get pushed? Drone, are you pushing me? No, stop, man. I was moving ever so slightly. Got it. He's dead. That guy in the leg. Come out. Yep. Okay. Need to find where they're all grouped up at. Down. Maybe if I use my uh, shotgun here. I can't really figure out much there. Well, building the belt too tough.
lag's messing me up a little bit. I don't know what's causing it exactly. Gotta repair it. Let's reload, repair, and then uh, push the magnum for a moment. so bad here. Maybe because there's so many zombies hitting things. You know what? Hold up. We are lagging so much. Um, let's lower texture quality to half. And anti-aliasing will go down a little bit. Object quality will go to low. We'll just lower the stuff a little bit. Just to help. Let's not lag as much. There we go. Looks like problem solved. I think this map has been a little bit too graphically intensive for uh, what was going on. All the zombies and people and stuff going on around here. Mow these guys down. Incoming enemy. Prepare for conflict. Be a bit here. Not a chance, not a chance. Ah, oh, come on. Where'd he go? He's gonna hit him in the freaking chest. Knock him out. Trying to get out there. Let's use the SMG here. Nope. Oh, gotta reload it though. Done. Uh, the cluster's gone now. Great. My sensors have picked up something. Destroyed the floor, but like, for what? You're going down, not up. There you go. Come on, come on, hit it. There we go. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Oh, 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 oh nice. Alright. Did a little bit of damage. Trading rounds right now. Go ahead and reload our guns while we have a second here. Make sure everything's nice and popped off. Honestly, I did not expect them to not be able to get to me tonight. Which is uh A little bit of parkour was required to get up here, but still, like for them to be able to like not get me at all. Hit him! Got it. 
Oh, he's already dead. It's you. Um, hey, my experience bar is not going up anymore, I just realized. Oh, why? Max level, but they're still giving me experience points. What level am I? 300? I guess that's the max. zombies here. Uh, okay, well. Hit him in the chest. Hit him in the chest. Damn it. There we go. See ya. I love how every night, like, the area I'm staying in gets just destroyed beyond recognition. First it was the, uh, the one house that we were staying in. All of its floors were just destroyed. Next it was the, uh, um, various buildings I went into in the desert city. And then it was the church that was ruined. Wait, no, the Desert City was the second one. We went into that second floor building. The first building, in the first town, we didn't do anything to, really. We just, I guess, destroyed some of the, uh, the warehouse area. All right, let's reload our weapons. I think we're going to get through this night without much trouble. I mean, they're already, like, slowing down a little bit from coming to get me. Uh, huh. Putting on another piece of clothing. It's a little chilly. I have plenty of time to do so. Zombies aren't even gonna freaking get in here. My senses have picked up. God, I could go make food right now if I wanted to, and the zombies wouldn't even both get to me. Jesus. God. Absolutely insane. Hmm. We're gonna do some searches real quick. point, I think what I'll do, I'm going to pick up my turrets, because I didn't have a reason to be here. They're not doing anything. And, uh, guess let's transition over to this building. Oh, we made it. I was a little bit concerned after I jumped. It looked a little bit high. After I jumped there, and I was like, oh, this is uh, not an ideal. We made it. Just fine and dandy. Alright, so if I. There's gotta be a way up here. A normal way up here. It's not jumping across the building. I did it! Oh, hey, nurse. Oh, God, they figured out a way up here, didn't they? Okay. Ow. Where's the way they got up here? Did they spawn there? No. I can't spawn on the fucking building. Oh, there's a fucking ladder. Oh. Huh? <laughs> Alright, off we go. Okay, can't jump in that. I wasn't expecting just a normal-ass ladder to be on the side of the building like that. Oh. 
I'm gonna top it here. That was a lovely, peaceful day. Now, all the zombies are still chasing me and shit. Fine. Alright, so this one, this area was a bust. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's find the next location that we'll set up shop at, shall we? I think down here we have a roundabout. There over there. Is this the pop and pills plant? I think it is. The one that's cursed us before. No, this is just a farm. There's no one that really sticks out to me. Like, we could go into that house, but I don't know. The pop and pill structure that we just get massacred in for. Oh, maybe we can go into this structure. Take a look. Uh, get our ammo and stuff here. We'll uh, eat a sham chowder. Go ahead and drink one of these. Let's go ahead and top off our repair kits. Top off our med kits. Hell yeah. Um, and then I guess we'll I'm just gonna grab my AP ammo, which we have into that stuff. Okay, let's go take a look at this building and see what it's like. Okay. A very simple floor. Some rocks and that looks like it's a building supply area. Okay. Master, we are not alone. No, I know. How much does this destroy? It destroys quite a bit. So let's let's go floor by floor through this building out since we have time, you know. Well, like night's coming right away. Um, okay. See a weathered bag in there. Maybe I didn't come on. Okay, sir. A little bit too high there the first time. Okay. So we got this building. We got stairways going up. We got locked area there. There's a hatch there. Very easily just make this so I can get into it. Ow! Uh, rude, sir. Anyway, I've got a bad feeling about this. We've got a rooftop here, which leads us out to here, which is probably how we were supposed to get into that area. Yeah, I'll move in there. Oh, that's a tool. Okay, and there's a cop. Okay, he's dead. Handled. Okay. And then from here we have the tunnels, which obviously there's going to be zombies in these areas here. Very, very obvious. Okay. And then this leads up to the crawl space here, it looks like. Okay. This is right outside there. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Then we have just a bunch of normal scaffolding stuff. There. One in that one, but that's okay. Okay. 
Yep. That all looks mostly fine there. We ooh, almost fell down there. Up here, we have some uh, electrical wires sticking out. Master, we are not alone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're always not alone. Why? Why would you frame? It is a pleasure to serve. Oh, robotic drone, the metal key. Why would you frame that? This seems weird. Yeah. Yeah, we have a couple of places where there's 762 ammo, but it's not like it matters for us right now. And then we of course have the roof access here, which looks like there's a hatch here, which goes to a toolbox with nails in it. What the really all oh, rude. This is not something you'd be able to get in. Got it. Okay. And there's smoke stacks up there. Okay. You would normally jump across here. Walk over to here. And swing. Batter, 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 swing. And bird. Yeah. Four, five, five, six. Nice. Seven, six, two. Okay. Got it. All right, so this is basically like the uh, last stand kind of area. Not much else to do here. Those are very sturdy. You have to jump across there to get to me. I could see this place being okay. Go ahead and put a turret here. And... It's probably gonna be one of those. Yeah, the zombies are never gonna get up this high. Kind of ones as well. I've got a bad feeling about this. Just to say. No. Um. The only way to get up there is back through here. They would go up this way, or they can follow that ladder. But crap. Whatever. The oh, fuck? Who do you think you are, sir? Huh? Come on, crack a book. Take it. Yes. You were not there, what? He, he was not there, was he? No way I missed him, if he was. What? And this goes up here, which goes up to here. Which, uh... Doesn't really help with anything, unless you go around here to get up to here in order to get to this room. Okay. Not bad, not bad. Let's just go further My down. My senses have picked up something. All right. Okay, so I think I'd have to kind of get across here in order to really do anything to me. What about we place this guy here? You can bop him off the things there. And then up here's the next path. Look at that sand and the rock. Okay. And then I guess we can put a turret here to boost him down the stairs, because that's fun. Okay. I think really that's all we gotta do, and then there's this pipe which I'm Sure, the zombies cannot cross, to be completely honest. Which means that we, by default, win!
But if they do, then they can probably just do what I just did there to get over to here, to here, up to here. They can just climb. Any eggs in this? An egg. Not that. Oh god, what the hell? Yeah, really? I'll jump back up here then. That's rude. That's so, so rude. Alright, so. If I'm here, their path of approach is gonna be this here. So, out of the way, they're coming up. Walk across here. You can also use this. I'm just gonna go ahead and. Not seeming to work. Not a uh, not dying. There we go. Let's get rid of that ladder. And uh, wasn't there a ladder here, but they can't use that one. I'll have to come up there. So there's that area and that area for them to get up. And uh, if they do. Congratulations to them. Go ahead and repair these guns. We'll wait for the next word coming. Hopefully this one will be a little more interesting. I don't know. I'm trying to find interesting places to like hold out against the horde, but it seems like if I get high enough, they're just like, never mind. I'm supposed to be fighting the base, you know? Man. Here, hold on. Hold on. Let's, let's log out for a second. 30 minutes is quite a long time. Let's go to 20 minutes. How about we'll get things done a lot faster. But yeah, that'll be, uh, that'll be nice, you know? We can do that and get things go. Mm -hmm. ba -ba 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 -ba. All right, so now time should pass a little bit faster and whatnot. Um, yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. I like how there's like one little, like, there's like all black on the horizon and there's like a little boop right there. There's also that like cell tower is interesting. That. What structure is that? Is it just like... There's also no mountain like that direction, right? So that's like way, way in the distance. Is that stuff not even like actual buildings you can go to? Is that just stuff that's loaded like in the, uh, in the distance? Trees? Stuff like that? I'm sure there's trees there. I don't know, it looks like there are actually objects. That's one looks an object anyway. See that move a little bit. Smokestack. I just wish there was more like visibility at night. I wish I could see further. I only think I could survive if I climb to the top of the cell tower with like normal blocks and just try to stay alive up there while the zombies try to take me down. We might do that next time. Figure out whatever building that is. Go over there and uh I'll squat let's see. Ooh, almost didn't make that jump. Alright. Night is upon us in just a couple of seconds, ladies and gentlemen. 
have a little bit of fun. Doggers! Alright, thanks here. Alright, so they are coming in from... A couple of them there. Can't really see where that turret's going to be knocking them down at. Unfortunate a little bit, but so they're coming up here, and then they'll get to there. I think I have to shoot through that. Yep. Okay. So they're choosing to go through there and destroy the stairs, I guess. We get a better line of sight here, I think. It's hard to see them completely from there, though. So. They are just going up the stairs, okay. There's a lot of zombies packing that little area. Oh, we got one guy. One guy's up. Will he make it all the way to me? Those two down there are pointless, but... Yeah, here. We got some guys running up, but where are they going? Are they just going here? They're like, oh, there's a ladder here, but... Realize that, right? You can't actually egg climb it. Oh, get fucked! That's what I thought, loser. Get screwed. <laughs> I like how I punched her in the face. Oh, that's good. Oh, the zombies can go across that little narrow bar. Huh. I'm actually surprised that was the big guy who did that. Very surprising. They're going, rather than going across those beams and through that door, they're going around the outside to over here. It seems so bizarre, doesn't it? She's going to try to smash into that. There's a bunch more zombies kind of down below me here, it looks like. Knock him out. Hey, humble turret, what are you doing? You're not doing your job, my man. Hmm. We're trying. But again, I think this place right here is too much of a safe spot. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Ah! How's that? Nice. That was kind of a risky move because he could have taken out this killer, which uh, would not have been great. Okay, this is not as exciting as I thought it was going to be here. I'm going to break this, though. There we go. Now maybe it'll be a little more exciting as they're trying to get up to this area. Try coming around here now. I guess they can't really get to me here easily, can they? I try to break through that, and then I'll, I'm guessing they'd probably try to break through this to get here. Hold them down, boys. Get them off the ledge. Demo guy right there. 
Darn, if I could have shot him on this ledge, that would have been perfect. Open up this nice hole. I'm surprised they haven't tried to destroy that, like, little blocker there. Yeah. If I could have got a turret right there, it would have been great. Just like punch him out. Where are the ones who made it through going now? Right there. Also, one thing I did think of while, uh, right before we started up today. I was thinking of how I could get it to be uh, better for rocket launchers in our current base layout, you know? And I thought, what if instead of bars across like the window area, what if we were to use um, like half slab kind of blocks? And then using the half slab blocks, we could potentially... Um, make a gap where the rocket could go through, in essence. Did that guy fall down? He must have fell down before he could, have, before he could reach this point. Shame. A real shame. zombies there, dudes. And they just keep falling off. Hilarious. I was just like phased through. Kind of funny. I didn't realize there was guy there. Sturdy. Yep, way too sturdy. Where are they, like, going? I've seen so many of them just, like, run up here. Do they keep falling off? Is that what's happening? If that's the case, I might as well just sit here and just, like, unload in these two staircases. It's like a constant stream of it coming up here too. Absolutely insane. I really want to get out of that window. Oh, hey guys! How did you get up here? Oh, he decided to jump! They got jumps now. They got hops. My senses have picked up something. Okay. That's what they're doing. I see. I'm picking up what you're putting down now. Fucking officers. God damn it. Stop it. Stop puking on me. Well, the ones who can get up are actually getting in now, so... They do have a very clear path to get to me. Hey, Drone, are you healing me, or, like... Great to see you, Master. You're not healing me. All systems go. How may I help? Maybe you are, I don't know. 
Oh, there's a demo guy right there. Whoop, oh, get fucked! There goes their entrance. Oh, nope, never mind. I just sheared off a couple of blocks on the top, so they can actually still get to me. Okay. Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye. Hope it's daytime now. Well, gun survived again. Weehoo! Master, we are not alone. Yeehaw, motherfuckers! Peace! On the bus, on the bus! Get off my bus, you goddamn losers! Yep, that's about right. Woohoo! Reload, reload, reload. Let's go. Peace! Oh, so that's the cell tower. It is literally just a cell tower. Oh no. <clears throat> well. Thought it might be in like a building or something, but nope, it's literally just a cell tower. Hey, burn boy, how you this. doing? Yep. Oh, there's actually a way up? I can roll. There's probably gonna be a zombie up here. We can't handle it. Yeah? Oh, wait. Is a zombie up here? I can go even higher? Oh, me. Hold on. Get that there so it punches them off. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. It does keep going higher. Can you just not? Damn it. Okay. Go ahead and drop down another one here. There we go. We can go even higher now, goddamn, okay. I wasn't expecting this. <clears throat> I was expecting that to like build up here. But you know what? I can take it. Ooh, ammo pile, huh? Just magnum rounds. Rough. Let's remove this piece because it's kind of in the way. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. I thought the drone was a, uh, bad guy. Okay. I can get rid of this piece. I, uh, have a nice little crow's nest up here. I 
go. Yep, easy. Go and get rid of this little ladder piece too. Okay. And we are nice and safely up here. I wish this was uh, not open though. Um, let's go and put the block there, I guess. Actually, I can do even better than a block. Am I an idiot? Got it. What I can do is I can just make a railing. Um, go with this. That's a diagonal, never mind. This one? There we go. Perfect. All right, we got an actual railing now. That's pretty cool. I can shoot right down onto the zombies. This seems like it'll be a good place. Let's see how this goes. How many, uh... How many can we think we'll survive here, you know? I think worst case scenario, I could potentially jump off this and survive. Get into my car. That's if I had my sniper rifle. Yep, that should take care of him. This is such a nice place. This would be like if you and your buddies were on a server and they were going to loot this area. Like uh, they were going to loot that building, that building, you know, the buildings around here, and you had a sniper rifle. You could just set up on top of here and like cover them. Like zombies that would be going in to attack them, right? It'd be freaking perfect. Especially if the buildings didn't have roofs. It'd be perfect, you know? Take out, take out the roofs first and then uh, loot the building, you know? Spend all that time doing that. <laughs> oh, it's a shame. Pat, pat, good drone. The shame that the drone does not heal. Oh, Seven days to die. Drone healing? Oh. It helps if you read the mods description. Um, the robotic drone medic mod. Allows for the robotic drone to automatically heal the player so long as sufficient medical supplies are placed in its inventory. Yep. Which means I actually have to put in the, like, if I wanted to have it do med kits and stuff, I'd have to put those in. That's rough. That's rough. So, you know, I'm getting the feeling that at this point, there's really not a whole lot I can do to actually die. Like, I've been running around, going to unfamiliar locations, having a day, just a couple minutes really, to set up shop and then I've lived. Even just 
running around the streets on Horde Night. Uh, I don't really get any issue. I just survive. It's honestly crazy. I'm the last turret up here. You can help me out a little bit here, you know? Well, I guess the fact of the matter is I'm just too good at the game. What can I say? Uh, I guess it's hard to be bad at the game when you made it this far. But yeah. The moon rises. It's not a blurry moon, to be honest. God dang, is that another tower over there? Nice. Well, the zombies should be coming. Master, we are not alone. Really, all I have to look out for right now is birds. Until I start hearing the, the thunk sound of the, uh... Ow! You didn't even make a noise. What the hell, man? Thanks. And my turret saved me by, uh... Punching it in the face. It's really quiet. Okay. That was, uh, oh, there, there they come. Here they come. Are my turrets down there out of range of me? So they can't, uh, Do anything? Is that what's happening? It seems that might be what's happening. We definitely got some guys coming up. Even though zombies are spawning. What the fuck was that? God, birds are so rude, aren't they? Like, imagine just. Oh my god! What was that? What did the zombies do down there? <laughs> that was great. I guess that's just a dead zombie right there or something. Holy crap. They must have destroyed. Oh my god, they did. They destroyed this middle support pillar. Because that was all that was holding up in that area. It just went down like a sack of potatoes. Oh my god. I guess I might as well just go down to the next layer since they're not coming up. I guess they can't come up, can they? Because they destroyed the uh, center pylon. They have no ladder to get up here now. But the question is, are they going to destroy the, uh, the pylon down below with the support pillars here? Or am I going to survive? Survive if there's just two. Let's see. I should probably move around to this side. Can we go from this side? Okay. Very not good. Be up here right now. Incoming enemies, prepare for conflict. No, my ammo! Ah. 
You bastard! Uh, that block there is missing. Who is that block? Man, I just lost 10 rounds of AP ammo because I accidentally clicked an extra one. Okay. It's not good. And if I had a rocket right now, it would just... Why did that head explode up here? If I had a rocket right now, it would be so perfect to use down here. You dirty, you, you, you dirty zombie boys! Come on! Come on! Show me what you got! Not coming. Buzz off, buzzard. I know they're vultures, but still. Oh, time to go. Thank God for the parkour skill that gives us, like, that's a bear. They completely demolished that tower. Oh my God. Oh my God, the birds. The birds are just attacking. Oh my God. Those birds bigger than usual? What the fuck? Those were definitely large vultures, yeah? The birds are getting like in my car and I can't get out of here. Here we go, motherfuckers. Later. Yeah. Never seen birds that big. What the hell? I feel like the big birds are almost like spawning purposefully to interfere with my car moving. Is there anywhere I can go here? There's like a there's a back room here. in the storeroom. Okay, this is a nice little area right here, I think. Kind of hide here for right now. Oh, hello everyone there. Eat lead! Alright, that was spicy. I'm guessing it wants me to walk over here. Well, the tower definitely fell. But thanks to parkour, we managed to survive. So yeah, it's basically impossible for uh, the zombies to really do much to me here. Just shoved, nerds. my last turret. There it is. I'm gonna go ahead and repair the M60 real quick. I'm there. Let's see if we can just keep going around the edge here. And then, ooh, here's the loot stash, looks like. 
It wants me to go down here, but if I go down there, I'm not sure I'm gonna have a way out. Oh, hey. What'd you drop, sir? There's a bird right above me. So there's that door there, but... Yeah. There's a huge freaking bird! Okay, we're trying to come through there, it looks like. I'm just gonna duck, because I don't want that bird to accidentally hit me. Alright, well, it's day again. But, uh... May or may not matter. Come on here. Come here, turrets. Holy crap, there's still a bunch of zombies here. Master, we are not in there. Yep, I know. Well aware. Have a second. A seven six two is very quickly wrapping, uh, very quickly running out here. So we will see seven six two disappear in the future. Now, just see what there's there. See what there's there? Yeah? See what's there. God damn. Because now we have a little bit of flea time. Oh. Alright, this door is unlocked. Is it? Got a bad feeling about this. Okay, let's go ahead and close that door again. Hey, lady. Where'd you come from? Listen, where are you guys coming from? Oh. Okay, we got some ammo here. Uh, of course, it's worthless ammo. I guess they didn't like to call it worthless ammo. Just didn't. Where are the zombies pissing at me from? What's on the wall? Over there? What do you. We got a screamer somewhere. That's very not ideal. I don't know why I picked that stuff up. Ooh, machine gunner! Automatic weapons do more damage! Hell yeah. That's what I like to see. Chest is locked. Shotgun? Kind of, yeah. We're here. Oh, hey, little guy. How are you doing? Another one, there we go. There. The 
This pretty much should be like on that side of this wall. It's almost done with this. Break it open. Do what we get. And one more hit. There we go. Oh yeah, we got nothing. Yeah, you know, I will take these. And these. Uh, hey, Rome Chan. If I give you these medical bandages, you can heal me later, right? So it's completely outside, okay. We're gonna kill a fucking screamer. Oi! No loitering. Are we getting some zombies right now? Part of the horde that I just didn't kill. Thanks for the healing. That's very cool. Okay, we need to eat a little bit. Uh, let's go ahead and eat our last toast. Let's go ahead and use that. And uh, I think we're good. All right. What else do we have in our thing here? Okay, looks like that's all. Let's go ahead and uh, take a sip of this as well. All right, now let's go ahead and interact with the truck and we'll just drive around. Pierce, hold on. Seven days to die. Giant. Giant vultures? Wait, there's a, a thread that says giant assing spitting super vultures. What? Weird. If I search giant from here, large. Hmm. I don't know. But it seems like other people have seen giant vultures as well, so I'm not the only one. I'm not seeing things. Hey, we're back to the uh, first place we tried to survive at and survive quite easily with. All right. How about we try this shopping center area it has a mall. Incoming. Prepare for conflict. Yep. Quick, just so I'm a little more secure. All right, let's try right, drone. Can I trade with you? Go ahead and take this aloe just in case we need it. I'll take this stuff back. Search this bad boy real quick. See if we can get any more medical supplies that I can give to my uh, my darling little assistant here. Okay, we're going to the basement. It looks like. I swear to God, she scares me like a lot when she's there. So there's nothing down here. I guess we're going upstairs. What is this room? An elevator? 
Master, we are not alone. Really? We're not alone, you think? That would lead me out to there. What about this room? Also out to the roof. See another uh, ambulance down there. Pretty cool. Hell out of here. Yeah, what do we got for medical supplies here? That. These. Here, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, throw some loot here. Go ahead and grab everything we can. Bring with me. I'll give her all the extra stuff. Go. Cool. Well, this building did not uh, have exactly what I thought it was going to have, to be honest. Um, we have about an hour left. Maybe we. I was thinking about holding out the passing gas over here. Did it seem kind of neat? There was like multiple layers to it. Roof and stuff, you know? Let's take a quick peek around here. That's locked. Let's take her out real quick. What about the main store? I don't know how much time to do Jump over all that. Okay. Oh, you didn't die lady? Okay. Leads me out back. Up to here. Um, then there's that area over there, which oh, I'm touching barbed wire. That's not gonna work. Um, luckily I have these. So I can do this. I thought the robot was a freaking vulture for a second there. I can jump across here. Not going ideal, but acceptable for right now. Alright, so here's that ladder. The staircase I saw earlier. You can get to the roof area. What's this? Let's let's not go in there. That seems like a death trap to me. We instead come up to this area, which is the loot. Which... Oh, girl and her dog, huh? Wait, what's shocking them down there, huh? My senses have picked up something. Is there an electric trap somewhere down there? Oh my god. Once that breaks, it is all over. Oh my god, they're out. Okay. Haha, <laughs> good fuck. God, I love seeing zombies just get bullied. I'm gonna put another turret like right here to help out. Uh oh. <laughs> I'm in trouble. Even faster than that, y'all. Come on. Let's reload this real quick. 
He fell. Nice. Ow. Oh, so phone someone finally came up behind me. God dang that. Hit him in the chest. Ah. Waiting for that guy. Okay. Got him. Later, homie. Here. Oh, they destroyed the staircase for me, huh? Okay. Seven six two is almost out. It's not great. At least for me, for the zombies, it's great. If they can't get up here anymore because they destroyed the uh, the staircase. I'm not sure where they're at now, but uh... oh, how did he get up here? There's some people who are jumping. Got some jumpies up here. Let's see what kind of food we got in here. Anything? A sip of water. I'll take it. Pile of ammo. Some bullet casings. God. What is electrocuting people down there? What do we got? Empty the pool? Not really. I'd like to pick that, but... Not gonna happen. Okay, come on, turrets. Let's see what we can, uh... Here. Run back over here. Backs against the wall of scope. Kaye, motherfuckers, let's go. Oop, oop, attack use, baby. Okay, take a second. Right, reload, reload, come on. We still have so much 9mm. You know what? I think it's time we show these guys what we're really made of. Now they're all grouped up here. Fall before me, you cowards! here. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Go! Reload, reload, let's go.
Ooh. It's a me, a Mario. Right about now, I can really use a demo guy. Jump back up here. Okay. Let's get them all nice and collected here again. And then uh, make sure our guns are loaded here. Let's go. I'll be able to reload before I get close. Yep. Switch to this corner now. Survive another night. No. All right. Not bad. Not bad. Well, at this point, yeah, I'm fairly confident there's like no way. That we're gonna like end up dying here. Here's a kid. I think we've officially beaten Seven Days to Die. I mean, all we really need at this point is just more ammunition. And we can survive however long we want to survive. And we have plenty of ammunition. So let's just go back home. And, uh, enjoy our life. I think we'll just wrap things up for now. Um, I say for now, but I mean, we're not going to do seven days tonight anymore. So. We've proven without a shadow of a doubt that we are just god tier at this point. Uh, there's really nothing to threaten us. We are able to survive a horde no matter where we're at, as long as we you know, run around and have enough ammunition. Um, really all there is to it. So, yeah, we are pretty good, but I'm just going to go back to the base Master, we are not alone. where I can be 100% safe and such, you know? <clears throat> Bears are so huge. So crazy. Driving through here is definitely destroying my car, though. <laughs> At least we're out now. The question is, can we get home before another Horde night, or are we going to have to scramble to get into our bunker before Horde night begins? Not that we've already establish the fact that we can survive regardless of where we're at. So, 
At this point, the only thing left to do is nothing. <coughs> we could spend, you know, hours, days, building our base, continuing to build it and make it even better. Which, honestly, hard to make it even better other than if, if we, like, add a bunch of, I don't know, SMG turrets or something to it, right? Like, just a bunch of things that would use up even more ammunition. Um, like, there are base designs out there that are completely, like, AFK based. Where you can survive the Horde Knight without lifting a single finger. Which I thought are kind of neat. Um, but they involve, like, the complex things like uh, use of staircases and stuff like that. But all in all, I mean, we did really well, I feel. We didn't, you know, lose too much. We, uh, where's the repair one at? We didn't lose too much. I mean, sure, we spent, like, a lot of ammunition. But at the same time, did we? Did we spend a lot of ammunition? I mean, the answer is kind of yes. Yes, we did. But, uh... At the same time, we didn't. Yeah, we really... With the amount of zombies we killed, and if we look, uh, we killed around a thousand. Um, maybe maybe we did use a lot of ammunition, now that I think about it. <clears throat> but also, a lot of that, I think, was just me missing. Which is not great. I was just missing a lot, it felt. And, uh, yeah... We still have so much 9mm and so much shotgun shells. Like, it's it's insane. Absolutely insane how much we got. Nice. I can go ahead and put the, uh, the turrets in here again. Alright, well, I think all we're gonna really do after 7 days to die, everyone, so... I'm just going to empty out the rest of my car, eat a little bit of food, just so if we ever do decide to come back to seven days, we'll always have something here, right? We, we don't have no ammo and stuff like that. We have plenty of food and water and all that good jazz. I'm going to leave some sham in here and stuff in here. But, yeah, I mean, I think we did pretty well. If I do say so myself, we, you know... Fought off a bunch of zombies today, and we got 19,000 kills. So, quite impressive amount. I do say so myself. With only 8 deaths as well. Very great. Very, very great. Alright everyone, go ahead and quit out of this game, go back to the normal thing here, so I quite enjoyed that, that was fun, going through 7 days again after it's been, I don't know, a year or more since the last time I played it, did quite a lot, had some setbacks at times, other times we just totally dominated like we did today, um, I was actually planning on going until I died, but we have not been in any risky situations. The only way that we would have died is if I would have run out of ammo and been forced to use melee. But even if I were to be forced to use melee, I could still just run away because my like stamina and stuff is like infinite at this point. So I can just like bop a couple guys, turn, run, bop a couple guys, turn and run. There's really nothing that you know stops me from doing that. So. The only way that I would die is if I threw my life away at this point. Um, careless mistake, which anyone would die from careless mistake, but I mean, the hordes aren't overwhelming us now. So really, we can survive for as long as we wanted to. And uh, we also established the fact that you can pretty much wall off, or I guess floor off, the entire area around your base, and it will, you know... <laughs> prevent zombies from spawning so you can essentially if you're at the center of your base or you make it large enough your entire base could be just a safe zone from zombies because they could not spawn during horde nights but yeah everyone that's, that's gonna be all for me 
Um, as for what we're going to do next time I stream, I have no idea. There's a couple of things we could do. Um, there's a number of games that are out that I have not purchased that I would like to play that we could potentially do. Um, I don't know. I'm also thinking about maybe putting together a new Minecraft mod pack that uh, involves the, the Create mod and seeing how the Create mod goes and doing more of like a less of a let's beat the game kind of Minecraft and more of a let's make a cool like civilization kind of thing. So, so that kind of stuff. But I don't know. Like I said, getting, getting mods to work and not just finding a mod pack is a lot of work. Downloading every single individual mod and being like, okay, are these compatible? Nope, okay. And all that. But yeah. Anyway, everyone, thank you all for sticking around and hanging out. Um, until next time, I'll catch you all later. Bye for now. Ta ta.